Welcome back, EEC Pride Group. Everyone on Facebook, Instagram, and and YouTube. Uh, what we have today is uh, another unboxing. This is the Smoky Mountain Army uh, General Care Package. General Box. Uh, this is the $199 um, Care Package that they put out. Smoky Mountain Knife Works. And this is for December. Uh, it's a little late. Uh, I think they had some things that they wanted to put in here special. So we'll open it up and see what they put in here for December's box. Um, today's unboxing knife is the Max Ace Babylon. It's a button lock flipper. Great uh, knife. These sold out really fast. Um, I was able to snag one from Blade HQ. But it just, um, just wasn't, uh, available right away. Um, they, I think they had to order them or something like that. But, um, this is my safe queen button lock. Um, just gonna do an unboxing with it. And that's about all I've done with it, um, so far. Haven't carried it. It's just stayed in my uh, pouch. Um, and that's just what it is. But it's just a stretched out sumo. And I have a sumo. And I needed to add something like this to my collection. And just go from there. Plus I really enjoy button locks. So. I did something to my thumb and and everything but we'll go ahead and get into this package and see what we have from smoky mountain knife works for their care package this month it is a great slicer good belly on the blade if i can hit the from there confidential thing a lot of packing this month let's take a peek and make sure I don't have any criteria underneath here Here's what we have overview of the box how it looks and we'll put this off to the side and pull up things as as we grab them so you can see them so let's get out care package So, first off, candy canes. Bunch of candy canes. That's good. Mrs. Lyons likes those candy canes. All right. And we got some stickers. We got another Bladers King. And we got the holiday SMKW holiday sticker with Santa on it. It's pretty nice. So set those off to the side here. All right, let's open this up and see what our first item is in the GI box. A 
that would be the first item is a Mercury Kukri black rubber handle features a 10 inch stainless steel Kukri blade with a satin finish, this full tang fixed blade has a black textured plastic handles and lanyard hole. It is 15.11 inches overall and weighs 18.8 .8 ounces. Smoky Mountain Knife Works price is $19.99. So, I'll just pull this out. And that's just what it is. It's a kookery. They're, they're good for, you know, hacking down different things and, and everything. So, a $20 kookery, that's not terrible. Alright, that's a user for sure. So, this box is $29.99 value. So first first product in there is a twenty dollar kukri, is what Smoky Mountain Knife Works sells it. Next item is a Smoky Mountain Knife Works pocket sharpener. Uh, you've seen them before, these little pocket sharpeners. Smoky Mountain Knife Works price is two ninety nine. Um, they used to just throw these in the boxes. Uh, as freebies, uh, I guess they don't anymore. Uh, so it's two ninety nine value. All right, next is a Rough Rider Rough Rider Blue Stone Wash Folder RR two two three seven is the name on this one. So we have the block box. Huh. All right. So features a 2.5 inch stainless steel drop point blade with a satin finish. It's a manual folder with a nail nick pull. This slip joint has blue stone wash stainless steel handles. With circle cutouts, it's 3.5 inches closed and 6 inches overall and weighs 1.9 ounces. Smoky Mountain Knife Works price is $6.99. That's not bad. That's definitely a pokey stabby is what Big Red would call it. It's slim. It's nice. Nice little thin. Pretty thin. Um... There's a good half stop on it. Um, it is slippery. It is just, is, there's no texture to it. It's just a blue stone washed um, folder, which is nice. Uh, Smoky Mountain Knife Works price is $6.99. That's not bad for a $7 pocket knife. So we'll set that off. Here to the side. So you have that. Uh, next is another Rough Rider. We have the Rough Rider RR1570. It's a black G10 trapper. Um... Features a 440 formula high carbon stainless steel titanium coated clip point and spay blades with match strike poles. Match strike poles. Ooh, a lot of oil on this one. A lot of oil on this one. Hold on, let me grab something to wipe this oil off with.
The handles are black G10 with brass liners and a brushed nickel silver shield. Pins and ring punched bolsters. It's 4.125 inches closed and weighs 4.4 4 ounces. Smoky Mountain Knife Works price is $14.99. Let's try to get these out of here. No, no half stop. No half stop on them. They are a hard pull for each one of them. I do like the coating on the blades. Those are nice. G10 doesn't have any texture on it. It is a... It is a textureless G10. They're starting to do something like Zippo do, or uh, Case does with the cuts on those. I don't know if you can see it, but they're starting to do the cuts on those like Case does. But they do them down here too, which... We round these right off and bring them up, uh, slope them is what we call them. Um, we don't cut them like that on the on the back side. But that's your Rough Rider. Smoky Mountain Knife Worth price is fourteen ninety nine. High carbon steel line. Okay. So you have two Rough Riders. All right, last knife is this one. Uh, feature, it's a Cormoran Karambit Liner Lock. Features a 3-inch 440A stainless steel hawkbill blade. It's a manual opener with a flipper and thumb hole this liner lock has black g10 handles and a tip down pocket clip and a finger hole it's 5.25 inches closed 7.25 inches overall and weighs 9.6 ounces smoky mountain knife works price is 17.99 that's a pretty nice presentation you have authentic cormoran knife. So you have some paperwork. I'm not familiar with cormoran. Poison for the trolls. Nice little microfiber cleaning cloth. Looks like a microfiber bag. We need to open up a little bit more. Huh. Well. Made in China. Let's see if it flips. Nope. Not all the way. Nope. You gotta light switch it. And that, it's got a stiff liner lock yeah you gotta really light switch it you gotta just grab that tip and light switch oh it's tip down pocket clip i mean it's got a good good purchase on it for your hand i have a large glove size hand i'm just not a cram it person that's all um 
never been into them. Um, I get that they're they have a use. Why would you put a freaking sticker on a blade? I hate that. Stupid China. Uh, maybe it just needs to be worked in. But not going to happen for me. Smoky Mountain Knife Works price is $17.99. So that's, that's your uh, General's box, or your GI level box for $29.99. You definitely have your value um, in this month for that price. But... Good presentation on this knife, but just not my cup of tea, basically. And we'll just set this back down in there. Just what it is. So that's that's all your your knives. So you have the cookery, you have the sharpener, you have a rough rider slip joint, another rough rider slip joint, high carbon, titanium um, coated blades, and then a tactical um, karambit. So that is your value for um, the GI level box. Uh, next up is the Officers Club box. And it looks like there's two items in the Officers Club box. So let me uh, set this stuff off to the side here. And uh, we'll go from there. So just set this stuff up front here. So, then we will go ahead and grab the Officer's Club box. So, looks like we have a Buck 263 Highline Frame Lock. So, that is this knife. So, that's the Highline. Features a 3.25 inch D2 steel blade with stone wash finish it is a manual opener with a flipper and ball bearing pivot system this frame lock has gray anodized aluminum and stainless steel handles with a g10 inlay and bronze hardware and a stainless steel tip up pocket clip it's 4.375 inches closed and 7.5 inches overall and weighs 3.9 ounces smoky mountain knife works price is 39.99 or 36.99 sorry 36.99 for this buck. The buck highline frame lock. Pretty nice. Cleaver style. Modified cleaver style. It is a frame lock. Which is nice. It does flip, so this is a better buck. And it drops shut. That is pretty good. D2. And it's like a stonewashed D2. But that's a nice, a nice, look at the bronze hardware on it. You got a bronze, bat, bronze black back spacer. And a bronze pivot. And bronze hardware. That's nice. It's actually a nice nice work knife. That would be a nice work knife. 
we'll see how that fits in my pocket but that's that's a good one that's definitely a good one i wonder i wonder if that one's made in no nope, made in china dang so not very many bucks made in the u.s anymore it seems like but that's got good action on it, so that's a plus. So that is a plus. So that's good. So that was a good knife in that box for the officers club. And it looks like we have a CRKT Biwa. SMKW exclusive OD green. All right, let's grab this out. It's very light. Features a 3.02 inch 12 CR 27 stainless steel drop point blade with a satin finish and Smoky Mountain exclusive olive drab. I'll grab green G10 handles. This full tang fixed blade is 0.11 inches thick and weighs just 1.6 ounces. It's 6.63 inches overall and includes a leather sheath with a belt loop designed by Alan Foltz and available only at Smoky Mountain Knife Works. Smoky Mountain Knife Works price is $48.99. So, $48.99. So, let's pull this out of the sheath. Oh, very thin. Very, very thin. It's got a good, I got a good grip on it. That'd be a nice uh, bird and trout knife. So, if you're small game or... Or um, trout fish or anything like that. That would be a perfect knife for um, filleting and, and doing what you need to do. Uh, it's got a good good she leather sheath. You might want to throw some, if you're in a trout fish with it, you'd probably have to throw some uh, leather cure on this and rub it in. But it's double stitched. Which is nice to see. And it's a nice thick uh, leather. Um, so that is definitely a plus. That's a nice little, um, like I said, bird and trout knife basically is what it is. So that's nice. And this lanyard adds to it. So that's nice. Nice little green with the orange G10 inlay. So, it's a nice little, little knife, little slicer, thin. That's nice. So, that's, uh, that's that. proofing piece so that's your officer's club so you had the buck buck highline frame lock and you had the crkt biwa i think that's how you spell it b-i-w-a so cr two three eight two od so it's an exclusive for smoky mountain knife works so We'll go ahead and um, set this out here, and we'll close this up. Close this up. And set this up front. So, so far we have one, two three, four, five, six knives and, and a sharpener. So, not too bad. 
So six knives plus a sharpener. It's not too bad. So um, throw this away. All right, last knife. All right, last knife is the general's box. This is the um, this is this comes in the one ninety nine package. So you get all these knives and then you get this um this one so we have another mkm azonzo this is the mkm smoky mountain knife works exclusive jungle wear carbon fiber cleaver and a stone wash all right we'll go ahead and Open this up. Just slice it right here on that sticker. So what we have is features a 2.36 inch bowler M390 stainless steel cleaver with a stone washed finish and a blade thickness of point, point 0.16 inches it's a manual folder with a thumb hole the liner lock has jungle flow fat carbon handles with a green anodized aluminum spacer and pivot ring so there's your pivot ring there's your backspacer and wire clip it is 3.47 inches closed 5.87 inches overall and weighs 2.82 ounces designed by Jap jasper voxnez and handmade in Manigo, Manigo, Italy. So, there we go. It, these are just too small for my big, big hands. These just are too small blades for my big hands. Um. I mean, action is is decent. I like the I like the um, the style of the blade. Yeah, action's good. So, but that's the Azonzo MKM Jungle Wear Fat Carbon. With a cleaver blade. That's not bad. It flicks. Flicks pretty well. Not bad. Not bad. I also have. Uh, their. Lava flow. It comes with the tool. And, and care instructions. And everything. So. That's cool. M390. That's always nice to see. Uh, Smoky Mountain Knife Works price is $131.99. So definitely have your $200 value um, in just basically um, these three knives. So um, these three knives right here and then all these are just bonus basically. So you what does that make it? Uh, 265 dollar value, basically, for the box. That's not bad. I mean, there's definitely been better months. That's for sure. Um, so, 
but this was closing out the year. Um, I was hoping with a bang, but it's definitely not a poor, poor box. Um, they struggled back in, I want to say it was, was it October? October's box or September's box. One of the boxes just, the value was just like $50 more than what you were paying. So, um, and then there was some months, um, that you got a $200 knife, like the $200 bug out. So, it really depends. I mean, it, that's why they call it a mystery box. So you have, it, it's a mystery what they're going to include. So, but it is what it is. And it, I I enjoy these boxes. I use a majority of the stuff as giveaway items. Um, and that's just what it is. So, um this is probably going to be a giveaway item. Um, this will probably be a giveaway item. Well, probably not because shipping this would be expensive. But this will be a giveaway item. Sharpener will be a giveaway item on my channel. Um, this will probably get some use. Um, this may get some use in the springtime. Um, we'll see unless someone wants it or, you know, or anything like that. Uh, this will just go in my collection of small knives unless someone wants to buy it from me. So, um, if you're looking for the jungle fat carbon, I have this one and I have, um, I have this one. So I have... I have two Azanzos. Um, that I got from these boxes. So I have the Lava Flow. Um, fat Carbon. With the. The Clip Point Blade. And then I have the Jungle. Jungle Wear with the. The Cleaver Style. They're just, they're just really too small for me, um, to really enjoy them and, and put some good use on them. So, um, I'd rather them go to someone that, that's going to use them and everything like that. So if you're looking for one, you know, hit me up. Um, I'll probably shoot you a pretty good deal on them and just go from there. Um, they are brand new, not, not used you know, uh, items. So like I said, um, just a little bit too small for me. It will just go in my, um, collection. So, but I appreciate you everybody in the Lions EDC pride group. Um, everyone on Facebook and here on YouTube and Instagram. Um, Oh, we have red and green, or green and red for, uh, for Christmas. I see the theme. So there's green here, um, for Christmas. Green, green. So, Christmas colors. I guess they're going for a Christmas theme in their main box. That's cool. Good, uh good to see so i appreciate you everybody um hit me up if you're interested in anything um i'm gonna compile a knife uh sale uh there's some up on my website uh also uh check out my instagram stories and and stuff like that Hit me up on Instagram if there's something that you are looking for. Um, I can usually hunt them down. I've got a few uh, dealership things uh, that I have set up uh, just because of my business. Also, if you guys are looking for any case knives, uh, I got a 
good um good discount uh as an employee so if there's a case knife that you're looking for uh let me know i'll see if it's available at the store and tell you what the price is and let you know if you or let me know if you want to uh purchase it and we can set up a payment uh option i have paypal i have venmo um i also have credit card processing but you know that charges me three percent plus a processing fee so that would be last route um to go but uh, I appreciate you, everybody. Thank you very much uh, for viewing. Um, this will be um, the end of the year. Um, December's Smoky Mountain Knife Works Care Package General's Box. And I appreciate everybody and we'll see what the new year brings us for the general's box um here in january hopefully they knock it out of the park uh for that so i appreciate you thank you very much bye edc pride group